What's up, Sun Rays? Welcome back to my channel. It's Ray. If you're new here, welcome. Today I am going to be reviewing the So De Janeiro Bum Bum Summer Jet Set. So if you remember, I showed you this set in an unboxing. Anyway, I said that I was going to be traveling and I would take this and try it out and everything. Well, I ended up not taking it, but I have since tried it out here um, at home just so I can do a review on it and see if I wanted to repurchase any of these things for my next travel. So let's go ahead and get into it now. I'm gonna be honest about these products and what I say may be different than what you are hearing on YouTube and you know, in the reviews of these products on the site and everything else. So, um, here are my honest thoughts. So, what came in the set, let's go with that first. So, what came in the set was the shower gel or shower cream, the bum bum cream that is the fan favorite, and the body spray and I still have quite a bit of the body spray left. So I said, let me go ahead and just try this out. So I went in the shower and I used the moisturizing cream gel. So this cream gel is exactly what it says. It is a cream. There's a little lever here that you push down, which is kind of difficult to push down, especially if you have bigger hands, but hey, that's not a deal breaker. It's pretty much gone, so I'm gonna see if I can get anything out. Okay, so this is what it looks like, okay? So it is a cream gel. It does have that same smell as the Bum Bum Cream. It's kind of a coconutty, vanilla-ish, some type of nut type smell to it. It smells good. It smells like you are out on the beach, okay? It does smell like that. It smells like one of the tropical drinks and you're sitting on the beach. It smells like that. So I used it on a wash rag. It lathered up quite well, showered my body with it, rinsed off, yada, yada, yada. Um, so that worked. It does not have a lasting fragrance. So once you rinse it off, you pretty much don't smell like this anymore. So, you know. The other thing is, is when I used it some other times, I used it with one of my little gloves. That worked okay. It didn't lather as well, but it worked okay. And I've also used it with one of the little um, mesh squeezies or whatever. That lathered really good. That worked okay. So, is there really anything bad to say about this cream? No, besides the price. Do I feel like it is so good that I want to pay the price for it. No, I like a lot of other body creams just as well. Does it smell good when you're showering with it and putting it on? Yeah, you get the smell um, of it. But like I said, once you rinse it off, you don't smell it anymore. So that's the thing with this. I think that it's good if you want to, you know, feel um, like you're on trend with what everybody's using and you know, stuff like that, and you don't mind paying the money for it, I'd say pick it up, give it a try. You probably would like it. I mean, it cleanses it, makes your, your body feel, um, you know, somewhat soft, not overly soft, not for the price of it is what I'm saying. So, um, eh, would I repurchase it? Probably not. Then uh, I went in, I got out of the shower, I used the Bum Bum Cream, because everybody talked about that. I still have some of that left, so this is not empty, and I will continue to use it. The, here's the texture of the Bum Bum Cream. It's very whipped. It has a beautiful texture to it. Beautiful texture, it just feels soft and creamy and smooth and silky between your fingers. I love the texture. When you, uh, when you put it on, it um, soaks right in. You don't have to rub and rub and rub like you do with some body butters. Um, so this does absorb into your skin uh, quite nicely. Um, it does have the Bum Bum scent as well. Does this scent linger all through the day? No, I used this by itself before. Didn't really smell it later on during the day. And I was like, well, shoot, you know, how come I don't smell like this? So 
the scent does go away. But when I use it another day where I put this on and then I put on the spray with it, it lasted all day. So I would say if you're going to purchase this and you like the smell, you want the smell to stay with you all day and be more lasting, get the spray to go along with it. You're gonna have a better chance of having that last all day long. This didn't last all day long on its own. That's how it worked for me. Together it did and I like the smell of it together. I like to use it in the evenings and I just go to bed kind of smelling like this. It's not something that I wanna wear out every day or anything and smell like coconuts and stuff like that every day all day or whatever but it was okay it made me feel clean and fresh and a little sweet in the bed you know at night um so i will say that about it but the texture like i said is good at first i was like eh, it's kind of overrated but i started to kind of feel the texture and and I did feel like it moisturized my skin. I did feel like my skin stayed moisturized. Again, do I feel like it is worth the price? That's where I have the problem with this, is the price. I think that there's other body butters out there that work just as well for a fraction of the price. So again, if you wanna be bougie, if you wanna be, you know, that girl, if you wanna be on trend with everybody, if you wanna say, oh yes, I use Bum Bum, then pick it up. I think you'll like it or whatever. But for me, someone who is more practical, who want to be a little bit more frugal with her coins, um, I don't know that I would repurchase this. If I could find it on sale, I probably would because a little does go a long way. I think it will last you quite a while. However, there are other body creams that I think, or um, body butters that I think work just as well for a fraction of the price. So again, it's up to you. You determine what you think. To me, I could take it or leave it. I could take it or leave it. So it's not everything is cracked up to be. If I were to buy this again, I would definitely buy this again because I would want the scent to last. Otherwise, I could just buy a non-scented cream and don't have to be worrying about the bum bum or the smell of this. You know, everybody's talking about, oh, it smells so good, it smells so good, it smells so good for a few seconds. You know, I mean, I was exaggerating, but it doesn't smell good that long for you not to buy something with it to layer it with. And these two, they still did, I used this and then this, and I didn't use this and I still didn't smell it. So again, like I said, when you rinse this off and you dry off, you pretty much don't smell it anymore. Um, at least I didn't. So that's that on that. Um, now, I went in, I ordered something from, sorry guys, my battery ran out. So um, I ordered some things from Sephora and you know how you can, uh, you got so many points, you can pick a gift or whatever. So one of the things that was on that list for me was the Bum Bum Body Scrub. So I was like, hmm, well, since I'm giving these a review, let me pick this up to go with the set and review it as well. So it was just a sample and it was enough for one shower in my opinion, and maybe I used a lot, but it was enough for one shower, so it's gone. It does have a nutty smell, pretty much the same smell as the other stuff. It was a, I mean, I rinsed it out so I can't even show you, but it was a tannish color, light brownish uh, color scrub. Put it on my body, scrub my body. It did what a body scrub does. It exfoliated. Again, the scent did not last. I can't even hardly smell it in here. I smell it a little bit. I could smell a faint scent of nut, but not a whole lot. Um, and I didn't feel like I was moisturized afterward or anything like that. You know how some scrubs you can use, they have oils in them. You can kind of feel the moisture after you rinse it off, after you, you know, shower, even if you um, soap up after you can still feel a suppleness, a softness, a moisturizing to your skin with some scrub. And I'll do a review on some of those that I'm talking about that I have. I didn't get that from this. I didn't feel like it gave me any of that. So again, for the price, would I repurchase this? No, I like the Tree Hut better than this. That's just me. I like the Tree Hut better than this. I like the Product Junkie Naturals scrub better than this. Um, Pretty much every scrub that I've tried, I like just as well or better than this. So would I go out and spend the price 
on this scrub. I would not, that's just me. I can get the same thing from other scrubs for a fraction of the price. So that's my take on Sol de Janeiro Bum Bum set. I have not tried, I think they have a, I think they have a cologne. I have not tried the cologne because I feel like this body spray works uh, it lasts long enough, it lasts all day to me. So would I go out to buy it and buy the cologne? Probably not. I I think this is good to, like I said, feel, feel fresh around the house, you know, smell pretty good. If people walk past you and be like, oh, mom, you smell good. Or, you know, oh, honey, you smell good. You know, whatever. But I don't know that I would want to smell like this all through the summer outside. On the beach, yes. On a vacation, yes. Everyday life. Probably not, and I would be scared that it would um, bring bees. <laughs> I don't like bees, guys. So, I don't know that it would or not. I'm just talking now. My, my thing is, they're good. Are they great? Not to me, not for, they're not explosive enough for the price. That's, that's my thing with these. It's just, I think they're overpriced. That's just me. Now, I will say that I think this is, I think they are supposed to have good ingredients. I think it's supposed to be like um, a clean brand, uh, good for the environment, uh, things of that sort, vegan, I think. So if those things are important to you, then by all means, you know, do that. I don't know, you know, I'm not that person, so I don't know how much, many other brands and products do all that, but if that's what you're looking for, then these may be well worth it for you. But for me, I think I got some other things that I would pick up before these. Like I said, this Bum Bum Cream, I like the whipness of it. I like um, the, the smell. I like that a little goes a long way. I like that it's so thin. I like these two together for long lasting scent. So if I found this on sale, I may pick it up. Probably not, but I may. And if I did, I definitely would want to have this on hand. I don't know that I would pick this up without having this on hand. That's just me. So guys, that is my take on So De Janeiro Bum Bum set. Let me know what you feel about it. Do you love it? Do you hype it up to everybody? Or do or are you like me, just kind of like, okay, I tried it. I wasn't missing nothing, but glad I gave it a try. So now I know what everybody's talking about. Um, let me know in the comment section below. I'm not trying to bash the brand or anything. I'm giving you the pros and the cons. Like I said, I think it's good. I just think that it could be priced differently. But um, that's it. Hopefully this video helped you in some way. If you were on the fence about these products, hopefully I could help you make a decision. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.